two out here and I think it's like a Wednesday and I'm going to Colorado today and I just want to tell you guys how bad I feel for not making videos in a very long time and how horrible apparently to this one person who posted all my DIY videos called me horrible so I guess I'm apparently horrible now. Okay, so I'd like to make a video to apologize because I did say a few comments that I did not mean to. Um, and by saying smart mouth on that video, I meant saying that she's really smart and I didn't even think of that. I guess I didn't really notice what I was putting down and... Apology done. And, um, I'm also going to give you guys tips on how to resist this bullying thing. And it's probably nothing that the teacher has ever given to you. Let's go. Okay. Number one. If you have a person and he intends to back talk or her intends to back talk to you, you gotta talk back. You could be like, mm hmm. Or you could say, shut up, you know, I'm fabulous. And they'll have no idea whatsoever what you're saying. If you're a little kindergarten watching this, you might as well go talk to your mom. Okay, so the truth is, you are going to have to talk with. Uh, student counselors once in a while for bullying processes and stuff like that. Um, things will come in handy once in a while, um, how to deal with this. And then again, you're gonna have to say sorry once in a while if you hurt the bully's feelings because then he's just gonna tell on you. So, tell him the bully as much as possible. If you keep on doing that and he calls you a telltale, tell him that he's a big butthead and that's exactly why you told on him. Don't be afraid to tell them. Just tell them as long as possible, and then they'll notice that, like, they'll be like, oh, I don't want to get in trouble, so I'm not going to bully her today. Right. So, yeah, that is a good tip that you guys should use. Bye. Again, very sorry.